Hi, in this video, I will show you how to use copy, cut, delete, and crop tools for video editing in IT Presenter. Please bear in mind that these tools also work for audios and other kinds of objects. However, here I mainly focus on video editing. For audio, it's almost the same. Let's see how to use these tools. At the very first part, I will introduce you the copy command. The copy command is useful when you want to copy a range into clipboard. You can paste that part into another place as a new video object later. First, you have to select the range that you want to copy. Then, click on Copy Range button on the timeline. You can paste this part into the current slide by right-clicking on Slide and select Paste. Then, you can treat it as a new video. Let's see. You can paste it into a new slide and it can be edited as an independent video. Next, I will show you how to use cut and delete commands. In editing videos or creating presentations, they might have unwanted parts. IT Presenter provides you cut and delete commands to remove those parts. The cut command deletes the selected content and places that content in the clipboard. You can paste that content into other places if you want. Suppose that I want to cut a part of this video. First, I have to select the range. Then, click on Cut Range button on the timeline. You can see that the selected part is now deleted and the video duration is reduced also. This means that all of the information in that range will be deleted and the remaining parts will be instantly joined together. The red mark here lets you know where you have applied cut command. Let's see. The delete command works just like the cut command, except one difference. The cut command places the cut contents on the clipboard. The delete command doesn't. Let's see how to work with it. Finally, I will show you how to use crop command. To be frank, the crop command simply deletes everything that's not in the selected range. So, to use crop command, first select the range that you want to crop. Then, click on crop to range button on the timeline. As you can see, only content in the range is retained when all the rest is deleted. So, you have just taken a look at copy, cut, delete, and crop tools in Active Presenter. Thank you for watching.